You're tired, Toto. I think it's time for a nap. Lie down. Go on. But I'm not tired at all, thanks to these shoes. It feels like I'm walking on air when I have them on. Oh, that looks like a flower of some kind. Hands off the corn! <gasps> oh, I'm very sorry. I didn't mean any harm. Wait a minute. Who said that? There's no one here. Huh. Hands off the corn. I must have imagined it. Why, I'm not even sure if this is corn or not. It's corn, all right, and don't <gasps> touch it because... Oh. Because, well, oh. just because. A talking scarecrow? How clever! Oh, I can talk, all right, but I wouldn't go so far as to say I'm clever. Oh, come now. You look clever enough. Oh, well, looks aren't everything, I guess. If I really were clever, I wouldn't be making such a mess of my job. Your job? Well, your job is to scare off crows, isn't it? What's been going wrong? Everything. All because I don't have a brain. I can't outsmart them, so they do what they like. They ignore me completely. Oh, well, if you go down, you could chase them away. That occurred to me, but the trouble is, I haven't the slightest idea of how to go about it. Oh, it can't be that hard. I'll help you. Don't worry if you can't think of how to do it either. It is a tough problem. But it's no problem at all. Just let go of the crossbar. Mm -hmm. Uh, let go? Yes, just lift your arms over it. Like this? Yes, uh... good. Now do the other one. Of course! Oh, but don't let go completely! Oh! Oh, not too bright, huh? No, it was my fault. I should have told you sooner. Are you all right? Oh, sure. That's one good thing about not having a brain. Doesn't hurt when you fall on your head. Oh. Poor you, let me help you up. Uh, you do know how to walk, uh, don't you? I don't know. I've never done it before. It's awfully kind of you to help me this way. Oh, I'm happy to. By the way, my name's Dorothy. What's your name? I'm a scarecrow, so, uh, uh, I guess it's Scarecrow. <laughs> I may have a head filled with straw, Dorothy, but I do know that much at least. Well, Scarecrow, this is Toto. Hello there, Toto. He doesn't know what to think. <laughs> He's a bit like you, isn't he? Oh, no. At least he can think, Dorothy. I can't. That's the trouble. So we're going to see the wizard. Well, that's quite a story, Dorothy. It seems he's the only one powerful enough to help us. Anyhow, we better be on our way. Good luck with those crows, Scarecrow. Take care of yourself. Hmm. The Wizard of Oz. I wonder. Oh, wasn't Scarecrow nice, Toto? If the wizard can help Dorothy, maybe he can help me too. Yoo-hoo! Dorothy! Toto, wait! Scarecrow's calling me! Dorothy, can I go with you? I... I want to ask the wizard for a brain! What is it? Oh, look! A pond! Finally! Aren't you thirsty? We've been walking all afternoon. I'm never thirsty. Good thing, too. I'm made of cloth and straw. If I drank water, I'd get all soggy and fall over. I suppose since I can't drink water, I never want to, if that makes any sense. Do you ever get hungry? You should eat, at least. We have a long journey ahead. You'll need your strength. Oh, I feel strong, as strong as a straw man ever feels. What I want to feel now is smart, Dorothy. You see, the farmer who made me filled me with straw so he wouldn't have to feed me. But when you're filled with straw, even a thieving old crow is smarter than you are. He's not a man, he's made of straw! 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 That did it. Not only weren't they scared of me anymore, they used me as a lookout tower to watch for the farmer. It was humiliating. I strongly recommend another line of work, pal, and I'm gonna tell you why. Where we have brains, you've got straw, pal, so we're too smart for you. <laughs> Since then, all I've ever wished for was to have a brain. <laughs>